Hey you guys, Fortnite Xbox Xbox here. Today I want to show you this tip for upgrading your weapons. It's a grinding spot me and my friends have been using. You get a lot of engrams from it as well as getting a lot of glimmer, so make sure to use your other seeds. As you can see, what I just did is you jump out and then straight up. And then the enemies will respawn. I keep doing that over and over again. You just get a lot of glimmer, engrams, and also upgrading your weapons. Right now I'm using Plan C if you're wondering. Because they were selling it this weekend. Or last week, I guess I can say. And you just keep doing it, and you'll get a lot of glimmer from it. Make sure to use your telemetries if you're trying to upgrade one of your exotics as well. Oh, and also, I wanted to talk about the new update how, like, all the new exotics are improved, or all of them are improved. Like, Thorn finally is usable, so it's about to be much better. Super good advice. Icebreaker is already been good, so they just changed up a little bit. But the class is finally back up to where it should be close enough to where it should be. See, auto rifles are doing well, and I'm glad we don't have to use all our send energy. Yeah, I also, I'm using Plan C right now, because I think it's a really good weapon in my opinion. It's good for Crucible, but I've been using it to do the Vaulted class. It helped me a lot. It almost one-shots all the Oracles, except in hard mode, where, yeah, that's when I use my Gradius. It's very helpful, and in the new update, I think you can move faster with it, and they... I'm not sure, I think, and I, I think that's what they did. And something about abilities. But yeah, that looks great. Can't wait for the Dark Flow to come out in couple days. I'll be showing sure videos of that. Can't wait to do the Dark Flow or the raid with all my friends. Yeah, yeah. Probably not gonna put it the first time I go on because I want to be surprised at what happens in there. I'm probably gonna try some of the strikes. That's what I'll be recording. And yeah, and if you really need like an Angrams like I did, I got Legendary Angrams here the other day, just keep grinding. It's also a really good spot. Well, okay, I'm not going to get encouraged grinding, but if you really need to upgrade your weapon, it's good. But you don't need to go for farming, I guess, anymore as well. Just because for 10 Crucible marks or Vanguard marks, you can buy any material, 20 of any material, from the um, Vanguard Quartermaster in the tower, which means it's probably saving you a lot of time just to do a strike or something. But yeah, still upgrading a lot of people on it. And if you want to get the um, exotic sharp to upgrade your final part of your weapon, you can either buy it from Zerf for 7 strange coins, or you can destroy an exotic weapon or armor piece. I wish this update came a couple days ago, because that's what I did. Because notice I just got to level 30, and I need to get a lot of shards for that. It's also really good. Oh, there's my legendary grip. This is also a really good way for completing bounties, like anyone that well, involves killing, or just the one for using rifle kills, or killing multiple enemies at once, or killing multiple enemies with your super, or just completing patrol missions. If you want to find this place, you go straight down from where you spawn into the Ishtar, I guess it's called, city. You go past the statue, go straight until you see a little small house sort of place. Thank you guys for watching. Have a good day.